located in northern Greece, on the thermic gulf of the Aegean Sea, Thessaloniki is the second largest city in the country. Brimming with ancient history for the history buffs, as well as stunning scenery, bars, hotels, and restaurants, Thessaloniki is a great place for tourists of all interests. Those who are interested in car hire will even be able to visit the legendary Mount Olympus. Choosing where to stay in Thessaloniki is an important decision that will greatly impact the sort of trip you have. If you're planning to visit Thessaloniki but aren't sure which part of town to stay in, this video will help you find the best areas to stay in Thessaloniki. I'll start with the city center. The city center runs from Aristoteles Square to the 15th century White Tower on the waterfront, containing four central streets Egnatia, Nikis, Semiski, Ermu, parallel to the busy waterfront. This is a part of the city that perfectly blends the new and old, making it the perfect place to stay in Thessaloniki for those who want a well-balanced trip. The city center features perhaps the best mix of amenities anywhere in Thessaloniki. Numerous bars, markets, restaurants, shops and attractions are located within easy walking distance from one another. The Dadaka is the most iconic part of the city, often referred to as the historic district or the old town. Located near the port of Thessaloniki, it is separated from the city center by Tsimiski Street. It is a great place to stay in Thessaloniki for those who want to combine a historic adventure with panoramic views of the ocean. For starters, there is the White Tower of Thessaloniki, considered by many to be the symbol of the city. For those who are seeking more information on the history of the city, the Archaeological Museum of Thessaloniki is another great location to visit. Aristoteles Square, also known as Aristotle Square, is one of the most popular parts of the entire city. Surrounded by many of the best bars, cafes, restaurants and hotels in Thessaloniki, it is a great place to sit back and relax, people watching and enjoying the views of the sea. Arnopoli is also known as Upper Town and is located immediately to the north of the city centre. As the highest point in the city, it offers stunning views of Thessaloniki and its surrounding countryside. Settled during the Ottoman occupation, it is well known for its abundance of Byzantine culture. Arnopoli is built around the city's Acropolis and is considered one of the most traditional areas in Thessaloniki. The Acropolis itself is known as Eptopergio and is a Byzantine and Ottoman era fort, which at one point served as the main district of a historic city. Upper Tambor is a largely residential area, located on the outskirts of the city. With local markets, shops, bars, and restaurants, it is a perfect option for those who want to get an experience of what life in the city is truly like for locals. Its name derives from the phrase used to describe mounds formed by prehistoric settlements. This is because it is located on numerous settlements that have been built on top of one another since the Bronze Age in 3000 BC. Carla Maria is a suburb technically located outside Thessaloniki itself, found four miles to the south of the city. It is a popular place to stay for those seeking a slightly quieter experience than they will find in the heart of the city. In terms of attractions, Carla Maria is well known for its abundance of sports teams, with 14 located within an area covering less than 2.5 square miles. This means sports fans are almost certain to find a game or event to watch while they are in town. Thessaloniki is a great location to visit for the whole family. If you want to relax, you can enjoy vacation playing in the sea, dining in the best restaurants and staying in the best hotels. Meanwhile, those looking to explore the narrow streets or take in the incredible views will be just as happy. Hopefully, this video will have given you all the information you need to decide where to stay in Thessaloniki when you visit the city for yourself. All that's left is to pick one of the best hotels and get it booked so you can look forward to experiencing the city for yourself as soon as possible.